Well, the high, uh, current heightened inflation readings could pose a risk to growth as the Federal Reserve System uh, deploys tapering of asset purchases and is poised to increase rates modestly in 2022. The fundamentals behind recent price hikes seem to point to a moderating inflationary environment over the next year, which would relieve the pressure on the Fed to substantially increase rates and risk an economic contraction. We believe that heightened inflation in the near term amid the Fed's tapering will likely both push both long-term and short-term interest rates higher, uh, but the outlook for rates remains low compared with historical levels. Additionally, low yields and other asset classes in combination with the ability to increase rate rents acting as a partial inflation hedge should continue to drive demand for investments, but not enough to dampen CRE investment. With strong investor demand and abundant capital flow into real estate sectors, deal volumes are likely to increase further, which led us to project a 10 to 15% rise in CMBS issuance during 2022. We expect origination volumes to remain elevated throughout this year as borrowers lock in low rates ahead of the Fed's tightening, which we don't think will be prolonged enough to dampen investor demand for floating rate SASB or CLO transactions. There are some additional factors as well, uh, which include our outlook for real estate returns that look very attractive relative to alternatives for comp comparable level of risk. U.S. properties also maintain a great appeal to offshore investors as international travel restrictions ease and cost to hedge against dollar denominated assets remain low. And limited extended distress with default of property sales and foreclosures during this um, recession following the pandemic um, remain well below those levels experienced during the Great Recession. And overall, we see the fundamentals pointing to moderating inflation.